What is up guys? Welcome back. It's Saturday, so I want to say happy Saturday and good morning. I want to say a huge thank you because we hit 2,000 subscribers and I'm so ecstatic. We hit it last night and I was like literally in shock. I was like, yo, we finally hit 2K. It hasn't been that long, so I just want to give you guys a huge thank you and let you guys know that I really appreciate that we hit 2K. I'm going to look into what we could do for a giveaway because I want to bless you guys with something. But yeah, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you again to all you guys and um, let's continue with this vlog. I'm gonna go link up with Amber and one of her little, her little sister um, right now for some coffee real quick. And then I think I want to talk to you guys about some of my fall wardrobe pieces that I've picked up and just maybe styling options for them. So we're gonna hop into that today. So it's the weekend, so I got my cappuccino per use. Again, uh, on the box. She laughing. Um, wait, that's can... yours. That ain't mine. Oh, that one is mine. Yeah. Look how beautiful. That's mine. Because you're you so natural that. at it. I had to do like several clips of it. You know how long it took me to get natural with it? If you watch the old videos, wow, I was Wow, look cringe. at this beautiful. You want to say this is Bella? It. No, no, no. no. <laughs> There's <laughs> Amber. What up? And her ball mom. Archive stuff. You can, eat, you can eat good and still wow. eat healthy at the same time. Wow. Dude, look at that. On a whole wheat wrap. Fresh but mozzarella. look at that. Right, I'm going to go eat and then we'll get back into this. Gang, gang. All right, so we're going to link up at the bakery. Oh. Damn. Oh, no. We link up at your house. Okay. All right, so I'll see y'all there. Wait, what? What are we doing? I said we're going to link up at your house and then go to the bakery. All right, I'll meet you at the house. Bye. Bye. All right, guys, so first thing I want to apologize because I know I've been procrastinating a little bit with getting a video out this week. I've been really busy with just normal life stuff and I'm trying to catch up on everything. And if I'm going to be completely honest, I've been watching um, The Leftovers and I kind of got like really sucked into the first season and yeah that's where all my time has been going but I wanted to get a video out for you guys for this week and so I figured good content um, idea would be to show you guys kind of what I'm wearing going into the fall weather and since it's been getting a little bit breezier and chilly and brisk in general in New York the last couple of weeks which is strange because normally it starts feeling kind of chilly mid-October going into November, not so much in September. First thing I'm going to show you guys um, on the lighter side, what I've been wearing. So behind me, this will be one of the pieces that I've been wearing. This, for people who know of archive stuff, this is Eddie Slimane for Saint Laurent when he was there. This is Surf Sound Collection. This is actually one of my... I always burp when I'm on camera. This is one of my grail pieces. Um, I've been hunting for this shirt in the size XL because since I'm broader on top, I'm slim, even though people think that I'm like this giant. I'm actually very slim, but I'm broad up here. So in some St. Laurent pieces, I have to go with an XL to accommodate my broad shoulders. But this is one of the pieces that I've been searching for for a very long time. This is the white, pink, and blue rendition of the surf sound bleach shirt i also have this version that some of you guys have seen from my instagram post most of the times i'm always in this one this guy was on my radar for a very long time i finally hunted it down for the right price so i'll show you guys how i've been styling this probably what i'll do is i'll go and film clips of me with all the pieces and i'll show you guys kind of yeah, actually i'll just show you guys what i'm gonna wear with each thing for days when it's not so cold but it is chillier, like maybe high 60s, 70s, you could throw a flannel over like a t-shirt. I would style this one with maybe a white t-shirt or a gray t-shirt underneath this with some light wash jeans or black jeans, gray jeans. If you want to go real out there, you could do white jeans. I've done it. Um, but I'll probably style this with some maybe distressed denim and I'll list everything that I wear because I don't know what I'm going to wear yet. But I'll definitely list it when I show you guys the clips of me wearing it. But I would style this over a white t-shirt, gray t-shirt, some nice denim, some boots or some sneakers for a chilled 
brisk day, but not something like crazy cold. The next piece, you guys, if you follow me on Instagram, actually, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I need you guys to go follow me now, um, at ariel.rosado29, so you can see all my fit pics. This is a piece, actually like one of my favorite pieces that Eddie has done for Celine. This is what's called the, if you saw my previous videos, you would know. This is what's known as the Celine Teddy Knit Cardigan. It's a blend of, I believe, Lana Wool and Cashmere. So it's not itchy, it's very soft, but it's got a good weight to it. This would be what I've been wearing on the colder days, like when it's like in the 50s and like sometimes in the 60s. It could be kind of chilly when the breeze is in. I also layered this over a t-shirt. Um, this is more of a statement piece than the next item I'm going to show you. Not only because it's such a beautiful bright red, but it's just got crazy detailing on it. And with this, you this should be the main piece. So I would just style this over a t-shirt like I said. I'll show one picture of one fit I did right here that I posted on my Instagram. Um, but I'm also going to do an on-body video of this and show you how to wear it a different way. Um, you could wear this with some Saint Laurent boots, you could do it with Celine boots, you could do it with white vans, how I did on my Instagram. But yeah, this has been one of my favorite pieces that I have recently obtained. Shout out to my Celine people. But yeah, this is for the colder days. This piece that I'm going to show you next is a piece that I picked up last year. Um, didn't get a chance to wear it, but it's definitely one of... I think I'm going to be using this the most this year. Definitely one of my favorite pieces um, from Saint Laurent. Um, it is the cat, the full casimir version of this. I had wanted this sweater for so long and then I finally pulled the trigger on it. Definitely something that is, in my opinion, even though it's a color, it's definitely an essential piece in the wardrobe because this can be dressed up, dressed down. It goes with pretty much everything in your wardrobe and it's just like a classy piece to have. Oh, it's right here, this is my red cashmere sweater from Saint Laurent. I love this piece. This would be for, again, those, let me show you guys, a little closer. This would be for those chillier days when you wanna just layer maybe underneath like a biker jacket or something. That's when I would wear this. Wear this with some black denim and tan boots. You'd probably do this with these and some black skinnies and call it a day. Just for like a clean, classy look. Um, if you're going to dinner, if you guys just go out and want to look nice for today, you could do this with black jeans, sweater, call it a day. You're looking real mature, real grown up and real classy. So I'll also do on body video of this and just show you guys how I style all of this. So we're gonna jump into all the video right now.
right guys, so that pretty much wraps up this video. Hope you guys like it. I hope you enjoyed the styling tips. Drop me some comments below letting me know which outfit was your favorite. If any of these essential pieces are in your wardrobe or on your radar. Follow me on Instagram at ariel.rosado29. And I did not forget the boot video is coming this week. It's just a long production video, but it is coming. I have everything ready. We're going to film it. We're going to get it out for you guys because I know that that is the video that has been long awaited and I've been procrastinating, but I'm going to get the video out. Um, so definitely next week I will push to get this boot collection tour out. As always, guys, thank you. And thank you again for... 2,000 subscribers. I really appreciate it. Let's keep this channel fully growing, fully going. We have tons of other content on the way other than the boot tour video. You know, I got crazy stuff that's dropping. So, um, yeah, guys, thank you as always, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.